Hi friends, I am Tyagraj. Once again, welcome to Tally Spotlight Knowledge Sharing Session. In this session, we are going to see Prevent Duplicate Supplier Invoice Number and Sales Order Number. Before going to the session, if you are new to this channel, please subscribe our channel and click on notification bell to get more future updates as well as instant update. First one, we are going to see Default Tally Application Features. Next, Customization Model Configuration Procedures. Next, model features for prevent duplicates, supplier invoice number and sales order number. Finally, key points to be remembered of this model. Let's see practically in Tally application. Once we open the company, we are in gateway of Tally screen. We are using latest release 6.6.3. On the gateway of Tally, click on accounting voucher. We are already selected purchase invoice. In that, we are going to enter their invoice number and invoice date. Next, you need to select supplier name, vision distributor. We are going to select. We are going to post one transaction by selecting product and quantity rate. And you need to select the tax ledger also. We are going to save this screen. One more transaction we are going to post it by using same supplier invoice number and invoice date. We are using default tally features. Once selected supplier name, we are going to select the supplier name is vision distributor. It's allowing to post the transactions even though we are using the same supplier invoice number and supplier name. Similarly, let's check in the sales order. From the gateway of tally, click on order voucher. We have selected sales order voucher. We are going to select the party name is Kerala Superstores. In this order number, we are going to enter Kerala Superstores PO number. Here we are entering KS-PO-456. Click on enter and select that product quantity rate and select the tax details and save this screen. One more sales order we are going to post it by mentioning previous customer purchase order number. By default tally application it's allowing to post the transactions. Let's see customization configuration features. If you open that customization file folder, click on slash and drag that path and copy that path along with the file name by pressing Ctrl C. Open the tally application, click on F12 configure, product and features, click on manage local TDL, enable this local TDL option, make it yes, press Ctrl Alt V and paste that path. Now we are ready to use this customization module, prevent duplicate supplier number as well as sales order number. First we are going to use purchase invoice. We are going to change the date, whichever the date you want to make the transaction. We are entering it same supplied invoice number which is already used in earlier you select different supplier name it will allow to post the transaction but if you are using same supplier name it will show you message supplier reference number already used this module will help to prevent that duplicate transaction or duplicate invoicing it will allow to post the transaction different supplier same invoice number but same supplier same invoice number it won't allow to post the transaction Let's see sales order number. Here we are going to select the supplier name is Kerala Superstores. We are already used some PO number. We are going to enter the same PO number for that particular party. ASS iPhone PO iPhone 456. Once click on enter, it's showing that this order number already used. This model will help to prevent duplicate customer PO number during that creation screen only. Let's see key points to be remembered. First point, this model will prevent duplicate in creation mode. In the alteration mode, it will allow to modify the transactions by using same supplier invoice number or sales order number. Next, this model is completely free. and this model download link we are sharing in this description box. You can use for your business purpose or you can share with your business network. I hope this model may useful for your business. You may like this video and share with your friends or your business network. Please subscribe our channel and click on notification bell to get more future update and instant update. Thank you for watching Tally Spotlight knowledge sharing session. Stay tuned every day something new to learn.